All right, all right. So despite the heartbreak, we still got a bunch of slow down gigs and stuff to do. So let's go do them. That'd be fifty five. Shit, okay, so fifty five E nine I C. There we go. Sorry for interrupting. Name's V. Hand sent me. Brianna, I take it? That's right. Martha. This woman here. She'll help us. We'll give you some space. Okay? Yes. Go. Sorry. Emotions are running high right now. Before we start... Need to understand who you are, where from. Life in Dogtown? Know it well? 
Spent years working for Arasaka. Years shaved off my life working for a corp. A dog town? Only exists because someone stands to profit. It's a combat zone, not a place to raise a family. Folks are here because they got nowhere else to go. That's you introduced. I'm Brianna. Six years back, the Tigers came after me, so I ran. Landed here. For most of us, our past doesn't amount to more than that. Running, surviving, which is why... I want to make sure that for once, the eddies we've scraped together will buy us justice. Real justice. How'd you put together the scratch for this? All of us here, we pitched in. We've suffered enough. Justice means what to you, exactly? Definitions vary. Want to hear your take? Leon Rinder doesn't deserve to live. He was a triggerman for Hansen. A murderer. All too familiar with that brand of justice. Good for you. Doesn't change Rinder killing Martha's son, Jason, along with his friends and four other residents. Jason. Caleb. Deontay. Omar. Pharrell. Matthias. Elisa. And Tamika. Rinder's not a bar guest soldier anymore. Why? No clue. All I know is he's brutal. Cold-blooded. A beast. What's his connection to Hansen? He joined when Hansen set up shop in Dogtown. Carried out orders no one else dared take, according to rumor. Why would Rinder be meeting with Jason? Any idea? All I know is that Jason was supposed to put Rinder in touch with the Scavs. Scavengers? Jason happened to be involved in some unsavory biz? He was a young man trying to get by in Dogtown. Wasn't no angel, but his heart was in the right place. Martha made sure of that. Why kill all these people? Any reason? Evil is evil. It doesn't need a reason. Martha's boy, Jason, he wanted to become a fixer. He set up some deal, brought Rinder to the stacks. But there was a dispute. Rinder opened fire and, well, was still scrubbing the blood off the walls. Identified the bodies by their implants. I see. Found this in Jason's body. It's encrypted, but I'm sure you can manage. Feel free to look around, investigate. There's still plenty of uh, traces. What's on the data shard? I don't know, but I'm betting that whatever Jason did for Rinder, it'll have details. Rinder will get what's coming to him. I'll make sure of it. I can tell that to Jason's mother. Good, I will. Now you know what we've been through, V. Don't let us down. You can count on me. Rinder's dog tag. Bring it to me. It'll serve as a reminder to this pack of thugs that we're capable of fighting back. I'll do my best. Get an assassination going. <sighs> I want Rinder to be scared. Scared to have it all taken away from him. Like he took from me. Understood. Marks like these. I'm thinking 50 cal rounds, Mark 31 HMG. Heavier than a motherfucker lead spitter that did this. Hauling it with a Gannic arm? Not a chance. Classic go-to for Militech Marines. Ex-soldiers like Rinder. I'll have someone bring us something. Scan did pick up traces of other rounds, which would make him the lone shooter. Rounds. Stash. Someone's been collecting different kinds of head here. But why? When I was little, after shootouts, we'd race to collect any casings we could find. Traded him between ourselves. 
Must be some kid's stash. Doesn't tell me anything about Rinder, but... Can't complain about knowing a little piece of Johnny Silverhand's childhood. <laughs> what the hell is that? Is that a helmet? Mm, a pile of scrap. Probably laying here for weeks. See these combat souls? Must have run up, boosted onto the roof of this shack, bashed his leg against the railing. That's a 10 foot jump for a man who's got to weigh at least 360 pounds, leaving dino prints like these. So either we're witnessing the fattest fuck who ever jumped, or Rinder's got augmented hamstrings on top of being chromed up like a goddamn tank. Is a riddle, all right. Take it out on the ground or something? Not his fist. See the blood? Indentation? Took some poor fucker's head and bashed it. Repeatedly. It's like he went berserk. Oh, Seems you're looking for a bored out killing machine that's lost all self-control. Sounds about right. Gotta love cyber psychosis. Okay. Let's go to the shards. Second, 
won't ask how you're gonna use it. As if I tell you. Yet I will betray another. Tidbit. I'm sending something to your mega building unit. A token of my appreciation. Till next time, V. Hold on, hands? How the fuck do you know where I. isn't enough, you need to bring back his own.
that sound. Organic food continues to be a major Blood stains. Almost fresh. Looks like they carved someone up here recently. Cuts on the walls, blood on the floor, optical on the table. Interior decoration. Scav edition. Reinder. At least what's left of him. That asshole Hansen's rotten in the ground, so... Who sent you? I'm here in the name of those people you killed at the Stacks. What? Hold on. The Stacks? Uh, I was there. Someone tried to rip me off, but... I, I didn't kill no one. I I've got these... Blackouts. Ain't always... Present. I'm sick, okay? Sounds like you know more than me. Cyberpsychosis. You and Hansen, what happened? Left you on the rocks? You got eyes? Toss me to rot in the gutter. My tombs too! Eight years I gave that asshole. Eight years. Kid enlisted at 20. Had no excuse. Fuck did he think it happened? Stuffing himself with combat wear like a pinata. Matter of time for he burst. You let scabs carve you up like a Thanksgiving turkey. Why? Cause I told him to, what do you think? Sold him my chrome. Might be twisted fucks, but they keep their word. Now you're gonna tell me that that hulking slab of scab that came at me was your ripper? That bumbling buffoon? <laughs> Just proof they can't guard for shit. Everyone's making you out like some crazed killer. The butcher of Dogtown. And here you are, hatching weak-ass excuses. I'm sick, all right? I wanted to pawn my chrome, collect enough scratch to get treated. Jason was my go-between with the local scavs. And here you are. Meaning he did his part. Except you tried to give me the Dogtown shakedown first. Started waving his big dick iron. Fucking savage. And then... I... I can't remember. B. 
Been doing Hanson's dirty work for years. Tying off loose ends. That all a blackout too? Fuck you want me to say? That I admit to all the sins I committed, remembered, forgotten, and all in between? Fine. I regret it, okay? I regret all the years with Hanson. Joined up when I was just a kid. Kept my head down, followed orders, whatever I did, I'm sorry. As if you know shit about Dogtown anyhow. Dogtown chewed him up, shat him out. Place must be packed with hapless turds like him. Be simpler if it was all Hanson's fault. But that ain't how it works. Exactly. What Cowering are you behind for? orders now? At any point, you could have hung up your iron, stopped killing innocent peeps, but you didn't. Fine. Make me out to be some kind of monster. Be easier to put me down then, won't it? Look at me! What else have I got to lose, huh? They fucked me over, all of them! I used to be a soldier. Look at me now! Had heaps of time to walk away before you dove off the deep end. I was 20, okay? Put my faith in Hanson wasn't the first or last. I make everything my fucking fault now? Then those whiny bitches I dropped at the stacks? Fuck them! Fuck Dogtown! I'd burn this shithole to the ground if I could, along with everyone in it! Better choose your next words carefully. Listen to me, just listen! I'm expired goods, a walking corpse. Can't decommission me more than this. Tell him Leon Rinder's dead and <laughs> you wouldn't even be lying. Do that, the gear I stashed, it's yours. Or no, fuck it, I won't beg. Shoot if you want. Let's say I let you walk. What happens then? Lay it out. I don't know. I'll, I'll look for help. Hit up some big name rippers. Not calling it quits yet. Hand up like some fucking cripple. Easy to feel sorry when there's a gun to your head. Don't let the murder and piece of shit tug at your heartstrings, V. Oh, he's not. He's not. <laughs> Done. Rinder's dead. 
You didn't let us down, did you? Didn't let you down. He's gone. For good. I hope he was scared. That he begged for his life. Didn't look too happy. Can tell you that. On behalf of all the residents of the Stacks, thank you. It's the least I could do. V, the target. Is he... terminated? Took care of him. Congratulations, then. Contract closed. Watch where you're Watch going! Your Fuck! Ooh. <laughs> well, if you There's a, let's call it a sports academy. Clients from all around the world come there to seek fresh talent. Contracts are signed while taxes allegedly go unpaid. It so happens that my client doesn't like people who cut corners. With my Netrunner's help, you'll enter the facility and extract the data that's of import to my client. Godspeed. Okay. Man's Merc, right? How much you know about the job? Eh, not much. Hans mentioned something about athletes and peeps evading taxes. Here's the sitch. At this academy, they're training, molding young athletes. Folks flying from across the world to meet them, sign contracts. You're going in as a scout for the San Diego Shredders. Name's Victoria Wilson, 28, and you're looking for a wide receiver. Scheduling you in their system now. You following all this? Got it. San Diego Shredders, Victoria Wilson, 28 years old, looking for a wide receiver. Well done. Just remember to keep a tight lip, no unnecessary chatter. Once you're in, find Fiona Varga's office, the Academy's director, and pull data on every scout who's ever signed a contract. Questions? Uh, cover story's a little thin. Ought to flesh it out, don't you think? No need. It's your way in, nothing more. Beyond that, avoid any talk about yourself. Just blend in, get the data, and get out. What's a sports academy doing in Dogtown? Ah, they're all over the world. They make athletes stronger, better. But if you want to enhance them earlier than the legal age limit, where would you go? Where no one gives a shit. Or as it's more commonly known, Dogtown. Whatever Hansen says, goes. And nobody gives a fuck about the rest. Arasaka demons? Not easy to come by. How'd you know they're Arasaka? X counter intel. Third branch. X cybersec. First. Looks like we both took a wrong turn somewhere. Sorry. I'm Baird. V. Okay. Quick scan and... We're in. System recognized you. Should be able to waltz straight in. Good luck. Sounds good. 
Sounds good. Bunch of XR Mrs. Wilson, if you'll join me, please. Uh, what is it? Everything you see here is protected under an NDA. Should any information about our athletes be made public, our contract with the Diego Shredders will be terminated, effective immediately. Ouch, sounds serious. If I may, I suggest you start your visit at our world-class bar. Drinks are on the house. Well then, got my first mission for you. Need you to neutralize three shots of tequila, stat. <laughs> Who's using these bots? Our verbal motoric integrated interface is used by scouts such as yourself remotely, from Asia, Europe, Africa. Since not everyone can make a personal appearance in Dogtown, we've provided a solution. Understood. I'd like to speak with Dr. Fiona Vargas in private. Hmm. Without an appointment, I'm afraid that won't be possible. Showcases happen often. Only when Dr. Vargas thinks an athlete is worth showing up, which is pretty odd. Dr. Fiona ever make an appearance at these things? Nah, she's not really the type to make it. The first sitting cooped up in her office downstairs. Can I get a double shot of scents on tequila? There you go. First time I take it. Which team are you scouting for? I'm with the San Diego Shredders, scouting for a wide receiver. You say the Shredders? The statistics oh, are more alive. I'm Caden, worked with Tomas two seasons back. Vicky Wilson. Wait, shopping for another wideout after re-signing your franchise stats leader? Man's an all-time deep threat. Uh, uh, what's his name? Look, pal, you say you know Tomas, but I don't know you. And I don't discuss team business with randos. <laughs> Bill, I think our friend here needs something stronger to loosen up. Work on your own drink, pal. Yeah. Fuck yourself, too. What the? That was tempered glass. What I wouldn't give to know the only secret. Sorry, about. I have to close the bar Forgive for a second. me, ladies and gentlemen, but due to damaged equipment, this athlete showcases on... Now's our chance to sneak behind the scenes of this fucking circus. Don't know if I'm gonna like what I see.
sports sports medicine something. For a... It's all right. What's your name? Tommy. How do you get in here? They let you out of your room? Well, I know a few tricks. My dad's a techie. He taught me a ton of stuff. Hi, <laughs> Tommy. My name's V. What you doing here? Uh, nothing. I'm just... Kind of here. In the director's office? Come on. I know you were looking for something. Yeah, sort of wanted to see if I got picked for a team, but still no one. You should get out of here, buddy. It's not fair. I've got all the right skills, the right chrome. I'm super duper fast. Your day will come. Just takes time. That's all. It's just, well, I'm getting old. You? Old? Soon no one will want me. Not even the worst teams. Dad said I can't screw up because we live in Dogtown and 
career in sports is her last chance. That's not true. Tough having that responsibility. But if it wasn't for your family, what would you want? Uh, have some fun, I guess. Or take a vacation. <laughs> That'd be neat. You're a good kid, Tommy. Know that. I know. Hey, chin up, kiddo. It'll all work out, you'll see. Say, little whiz like you wouldn't know where Fiona's terminal is, would you? Need it for a sec. It's right there. Can't you see? What would you look at that? Silly old me. See? I know everything. Yeah. <laughs> Clever little rascal. Now buck up and get out of here before Miss Fiona sees you. Yes, ma'am. I, I just need to find, uh, uh, that thing. Tommy, out now. Wait, uh, she was just looking for your office. Uh, I, I was just trying to help. Uh, please, Miss Fiona. Leave the boy out of this, please. It's okay, Tommy. Don't gotta stay. Fiona and I need to talk grown up stuff. Right? Uh, that's right. Now run along, kiddo. We're reasonable people. I'm sure we can work something out. What is it you want? Wanna burn this place to the fucking ground? A to the fucking men. I understand you're upset, but let's talk this through. You connected to a terminal containing my client's data, correct? What do you intend to do with it? Got it backwards. I'm the one asking questions. I have a duty to protect my business and my clients. You understand that, I'm sure. Business? <laughs> the fucking gall. Think of the children. Would you really deprive them of their only chance for a better just life? Just gets better and better, this bitch. If you please, just hear me out. I'd like to make you an offer. I'll make you a counteroffer. Oh? Get fucked. N no need to get emotional. Uh, let's be professional about this. Shut up and grant me access. You'll be destroying everything I've built. That's a fucking idea. Access, now. Fine. Here. You'll regret this sooner than you think. Just leave, please! Finally.
You knew they're chipping kids there? Why so dramatic? It's an open secret by now. Everyone knows what goes on there. Few care. If I've offended your sense of moral decency, I do apologize. Contract closed. Until the next time. Are v. you one of them? One of them. Hey, we're not alone here. <laughs> Hey! We're not alone here. Oh, okay. Can I... What is happening? What the hell? What is happening? It has to be. Thanks so very much for joining me. When we return, we'll do more gigs in Dogtown. But until then, thanks very much. If you want to do, please like, comment, subscribe. Just drop me a if you haven't already. And I will see you all next time.